I'm Misty Velasky. This is Ojai Valley News In Depth. Joining me today is Frank Malley, here to talk about a very special concert coming up, Relive the Magic. Thanks for joining us. Thank you for having me, Misty. Mm -hmm. So September 10th, Libby Bowl, 7 to 10 o'clock. We've got a really cool set of events coming up here. We've got a Beatles cover band, Abbey Road, and a Rolling Stones cover band, Jumping Jack Flash. So tell us about this event. Okay. This event is the concert that never was, will be, that night, September 10th, in Libby Bowl. Both the Beatles cover band, Abbey Road, and Jumping Jack Flash, Stone's cover band, will be playing interspersing sets on stage. They'll be set up simultaneously, and they promise to have a finale that's going to bring the house down. Wow, so this isn't two separate bands going on at two separate times. This is both at the same time going back and forth. Well, there'll be interspersing mm -hmm. sets, yeah, there, and there will be costume changes. So one, while one band is performing, the other one's changing costumes. Each band has costumes that show the different range of their eras. Oh, Especially sure. the Beatles are very distinct eras with their, you know, their black and white uh, Ed Sullivan outfits, and then their Sgt. Peppers, you know, psychedelic <laughs> costumes, and then their Abbey Road costumes. Mm -hmm. I've seen a few pictures of this, and these guys really are playing the part. These guys are fitting these roles. So tell us a little bit about each band. Tell us about Abbey Road. Abbey Road is a, is a group that really takes themselves very seriously. Um, they, they're very much aware of the um, the fan base of the Beatles and the responsibility they have to sure. to bring that you know magic of the Beatles uh, you know to the stage, and so they they got the look. They do. They have the accents. They have this on stage banter between the boys. They even have the um, you know somewhat of the looks of the Beatles, which is really nice. Yeah, they, it's surprising. I looked at him. I kind of had to look at that twice. And, of course, um, same thing with the guys uh, from Jumping Jack Flash. They're playing the whole part. They've got the greatest get-ups. Again, that's the, uh, every attention has been given. Every detail uh, has been great attention. Uh, again, they take themselves very seriously. Um, and they hold themselves, they are quoted to be one of the, the world's greatest rock and roll, you know, Stones tribute. They recently, both Abbey Road and Jumping Jack Flash, played at the Pacific Amphitheater in Orange County mm. and at the Orange County Fairs, where they sold out their venues. Uh, these are 4,500-seat venues. Wow. So with Libby Bowl being 1,500, it makes me breathe a little easier <laughs> knowing that they filled that, and um, we are counting on them filling the bowl as well and rocking the place out. Yeah, call me crazy, but I think you're going to have uh, not a whole lot of tickets left. <laughs> no, the response has been... Very nice. And it, it's not only here in Ojai, but we've been getting ticket sales from Orange County up to Santa Barbara County. And that's great. So it's looking really good. And of course, this isn't just a for fun concert. This is a benefit concert for the Ojai Valley Museum. Exactly. Yes. Yeah, so tell us, oh, what exactly is the benefit for it? Do we know exactly where those funds are going to go? Is there any big project coming up? Well, as you know, the museum puts on several uh, class events. Mm. Uh, throughout the years and exhibits, like currently the Smart and Savvy exhibit is going on. Mm -hmm. We're featuring the Men of Ojai. It was a follow-up to the Women of Ojai um, not too long ago. And Michelle uh, Pracy, who is the director there, does an excellent job oh, yes. with her events. And this will help fund those events throughout the year. Great. So it's um, fun for everybody, win-win situation. That's the way I like to work. Yeah. yeah. So tell us a little bit more about the after party that's coming up for this. Um, as I understand it, it's like a meet and greet, um, great restaurant involved. Yeah. Agave Maria was very kind uh, to be one of our sponsors. And we put bids out for the different restaurants to see where the party was going to go. And the Ojai Valley Museum board decided on the Agave Maria mm -hmm. venue. And I'm real excited because it's an outdoor venue. It'll be under the stars. Actually, it's going to be a full moon weekend, so it'll oh. be very, very special. Very cool. The margaritas will be flowing, <laughs> and we'll have uh, just some gourmet appetizers as well. Great. Yeah. Then it's just a quick walk right around the corner? On just a the... block away, and it's also going to serve as our meet and greet, as you mentioned. Mm -hmm. So the band members will be there as well, and it promises to be a great occasion. And, of course, that's part of the VIP tickets. Yes, we have three levels of tickets. The seating in the actual bowl... Um, are the general seatings for $45, but within that we have the VIP section, which are $100 tickets, and they include the premium parking right across the street, 
They include the, uh, a museum gift bag of appreciation and the uh, blowout Agave Maria party afterwards. Great. Yeah. And of course, uh, Relive the Magic, September 10th, 7 to 10 o'clock in Libby Bowl. Where can we get tickets? You can get tickets online at Beatles and Stones Libby Bowl dot com mm -hmm. or you can buy them locally here um, there's the Ojai Community Bank of course the Ojai Valley Museum Attitude Adjustment Rain's Department Store Ojai Creates and Cardinelli Brothers Music in right. Miners Oaks sounds like a good time we this definitely look forward thing. to it and uh, get, get some people rocking out here in Ojai. we want to make sure people understand that this um, this is a family event. Mm. There's, it's non-alcoholic, non-smoking event, so we're encouraging people to come and bring their family. We can see, I'm foreseeing three generations coming. <laughs> I think we'll have that, definitely have that. And we also will have some entertainers there to greet people. The gates will open at five o'clock. Mm -hmm. The box office will be open in that afternoon by 12 or two o'clock, 12, let's say 12 o'clock. And the, we have food vendors, and uh, some tie-dye clothing vendors, so we're going to make it a festive atmosphere. Great. Well, thanks very much for being here, Frank. We sure do appreciate it. It's my pleasure. Mm -hmm. Relive the Magic is September 10th from 7 to 10 in Libby Bowl. I'm Misty Velasky. This is Frank Malley. This has been Ojai Valley News In-Depth.